Howdy folks, it's Night J with Night J's Tabletop Gaming, and this video brings us back to the Pacific and the U.S. Navy. We've got the USS Fletcher DD-445, and it was a pleasure to paint, and I hope you like it. Enjoy. Here we have Warlord Games' uh, one eighteen hundredth scale USS Fletcher class destroyer. Uh, it was uh, part of the U.S. versus Japan starter box that they came out with. Uh, what's interesting about these particular ships in that box is that they're all resin. Not only the hull and base of the ship, but the superstructure is, is resin. So I put it together with some super glue and primed it up and started painting. She was laid down in uh, October of 1941 launched in May of 1942 and was commissioned in June at the end of June of 1942. She did make it through the entire war and was decommissioned in January of 1947 and put into the reserve fleet. During that time she was reclassified as DDE-445 in 1949, March of that year, and then recommissioned in October of 1949. She continued to be considered a destroyer escort until the end of June 1962, where she was reclassified again as DD-445. She was finally decommissioned in October of 1969. So a long time spent in the Navy with this girl. Unfortunately, she was sold in February of 1972 and ultimately scrapped. Although we have several Fletcher-class destroyers as museum pieces, she didn't make it to that category. She was almost 3,000 tons when she was fully loaded for combat. She comes in at 376 plus a few inches in length. Her beam is almost 40 feet, and she carried a draft of just under 14 feet. She had 60,000 horsepower on geared turbines, pushing two screws, and she could uh, come in at 36 knots top speed. When she did 15 knots, she would make a range of 6,500 nautical miles. She has 273 officers and enlisted men, and her armament was five single mount five inch guns, and two 40 millimeter Bofor uh, anti-aircraft cannons, six 20 millimeter Orlikan uh, anti-aircraft cannons and she had 10 21 inch torpedo tubes along with uh, ubiquitous uh, depth charges. I decided to paint this as the actual uh, USS Fletcher using measure 21 modified which was kind of a splotchy camouflage pattern with a light gray uh, the base color swaths of uh, kind of a dark bluish gray on the sides and then of course deck blue for uh, the deck itself. I think it's a quite striking uh, camouflage pattern in and of itself and it painted up pretty easily all in all. It, it, was, uh, it was a fun ship to paint. A little bit about USS Fletcher. She was the lead ship of the Fletcher class of destroyers DD-445 named after Admiral Frank Friday Fletcher. He was an admiral during the 19th and early 20th centuries and was awarded the Medal of Honor for actions as commander of Navy forces at the Battle of Veracruz in Mexico. All of his service was in the Pacific Fleet during World War II, where she participated in nearly every major campaign uh, from the Solomon Islands uh, through the Marshall Islands and escorting and bombarding during uh, most of the Central Pacific landings going all the way up through to a battle of uh, Leyte Gulf. A well-fought ship. Uh, she had 15 battle stars during World War II and five battle stars during Korea. So. Here she is, USS Fletcher, DD-445. Take a look at a couple of the photos I got with her here, and let me know what y'all think and uh, what uh, ship y'all want me to do next. Uh, and until next time, we'll see you on the flip side.
Thank you.